it looks like uh, the order is coming real fast you guys let's make sure that we will serve the dish on time it's an x i press the space there we go and hello everyone good day and welcome back to chef rpg looks like the Market Central is kind of busy. We have here Nabihas and also uh, May Lu. We also have Yoriel here. As you can see, they're selling different stuff. We have meat, veg veggies, and fruits. And also, um, uh, previously, we just did some renovation in our restaurant to prepare us for the soft opening. Hopefully, it's going to be today. And uh, especially now that it's like 12 p.m. Uh, hi, Thileo. He's the one who's actually uh, working with us as well. He's working at Milk and Wheat. So let's just head straight to Hazel. Uh, I wanna, I think we are more than prepared to do a soft opening. We'll see how it goes. So how are you doing guys? Hope you're having a wonderful day. Thanks again for hanging out. And uh, if, if you're new, don't uh, feel free to like and subscribe. So here we go. Hi Snack, how's the soft opening prep going? Is it ready? Is it ready? Is it? <laughs> She's so excited. Whoa, I can hear you just fine. Also, yes, it is ready. Let's go guys. Oh, sorry. My ability to control my volume goes out the window when I get excited. I'll keep the guest list as small as a kangaroo rat, which are not in fact the same size as an actual kangaroo. Anyways, I'll let everyone know. Wow, everyone in White Ash Harbor? Oh, this is going to be fun. Okay, so by the way, guys, how, how are you doing? Uh, how was the game for you? guys who actually bought this game uh, i'm pretty sure that you're having fun and also uh, just like me i encountered some bugs but uh those are just uh, things that can be easily be fixed and the important thing is finally we are playing a game that i always visual visualize myself after the wind farming star valley I, I was thinking of myself uh it would be awesome if uh aside from farming i would i could also uh you know directly serve food that came out from a farm well at least in this game we can Let's head straight to our restaurant right now. Uh, we have four tables. Uh, how do we start the uh, quest? Okay, uh, looks like we've over prepared. So we only need to uh, uh, prepare a seating for four guests. That's fine. Uh, we, let's see, not enough dishes. Oh my gosh. And more countertops. Oh, looks like we've missed this. Oh, well, we'll go ahead with this uh, shrimp cocktail. Okay, now uh, we need to just buy one more countertop. Okay, let's run quickly to La Gallery. Hopefully it's still open when we arrive there and i gotta say i love the layout of this area like there are a lot of debts to it like here there's a harbor and then you can go on top uh, here is the where you could buy some uh furnitures and uh yeah this is the central pl plaza right here it is really well thought and well designed which is really awesome unlike i like the the usual games I, i've seen especially pixel art like uh, the it's all flat but this one has a debt and uh it's just <laughs> that's how uh that's how this game has been well thought of and uh it's, again you guys it's worth every penny although there's it's an early access it's understandable but uh man it's worth every buck so let's look for a counter i think this is it right small bronze counter okay now i am totally uh confused so what kind of counter table i have here uh oak chef counter oh i think this one right yeah we have this only one though well this one is uh i think this one is for the home at uh, this one right here uh this should be it we'll get one all right let's go by the way uh yeah kindly share the comments guys um what are your thoughts about the game um as for me if you ask me um well there's this uh, this game still has uh has a uh, has a bit of a long way for it to be uh you know fully cooked at the oven and it, i'm pretty sure it will come out deliciously but as of the moment it is pretty edible you know in terms of gameplay the concept uh it has uh, a good loop to it let's just uh plant it right here this one move here just like this i think that is it okay i think we're done oh geez uh i bought the wrong <laughs> the wrong uh furniture uh countertop what the okay uh let's go head straight again to the gallery man the countertop countertop i'm hoping that we could do a soft opening today oh well i'll just buy all the possible uh, options we have for the countertop okay this could be a countertop this kitchen counter oh man i only have like 300 uh, credits now oh this one is cheap 47 credits let's just get this all right let's hope that one of these furnitures are <laughs> The one we're looking for otherwise um we're gonna have to delay the soft opening again but uh, definitely i'll try my best to do a soft opening in this episode i always forget i do have this um quick uh fast travel option <laughs> 
<laughs> all right let's do this you guys now it's like almost 4 p.m well we're gonna serve them a yummy dinner in that case all right let's see oh man this is this is it right all right yep this is it but it has a different color well that's fine <laughs> that will definitely do and let's go we have our oh i like this dark ambience oh, we have bianca here uh, welcome welcome bianca to our soft opening make yourself comfortable uh maybe this will be good okay she likes shrimp okay time to cook you guys we have a carrot and a shrimp and this is my favorite game so far is i i'm literally not good at this <laughs> especially uh there's there's uh two different arrows at the same time my brain just stops working all right at least we got 81 uh, points from the shrimp cocktail oh also we have hazel nice uh, all right looks like we have our popular dish the shrimp cocktail down up left up another up down oh this one oh i got that that was uh, some luck you got there right down oh right we have 95 points from that hazel's gonna love this okay we've unlocked auto cook for oh awesome for common recipes that use counter haha <laughs> that is so cool okay we have like one two three four people oh no three people for now wait you can't let me know if you can get anything else okay <laughs> all right looks like uh the order is coming real fast you guys let's make sure that we will serve the dish on time it's an x i pressed the space there we go one two another one one two three four five another hit oh that is perfect you guys grilled cranberry carrot all right uh what do we have here yep the orders are coming so fast oh boy let's do this uh down down the oh man right right left down left right right down all right awesome hey baby girl my, my baby baby girl is here say hi guys. say hi say hi hey. what do you want oh man they're ordering can i pause the game okay there you go Let me just pause it a bit all right you guys looks like i'm back uh what order do they need uh let's see oh i'm lost i'm so lost now okay let's do this it's gonna be an x perfect 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 great Oh, we've missed that one. One more and we are almost done. Yep, there you go. Grilled cranberry carrots. We have 80 rating from that. Oh, we have two uh, watercress salad orders. Right, left. Oh man, oh man. Oh geez, this is hard. I don't know, my, my brain just doesn't work if I need to press two directions at the same time. Just like this. Oh man, that's 57. Uh, better than nothing right oh i'm so sorry to whoever will get this i tried my best that baby girl all right there you go it's getting faster you guys oh yeah that is a miss awesome 64 rating at least and we have a more main dish coming right up there you go that is so perfect would you look at that oh that's a hundred percent man all right so I, I i'm guessing uh the person who's getting this is this a lady right here Let's say hi oh uh, hi uh looks like our uh server eloise is so hard working she deserves a raise i guess <laughs> hey ma'am that is the last dish for the day thank you mr yurio say hi uh, hi hello hello everyone hello everyone hope you're having a good day ah, that's my angel she's like uh She's eight, uh, three years old and uh, her favorite uh, food is actually regular. So she was asking medicine earlier. She meant regular. Okay, madam. Uh, what well, looks like she's happily walking away at least. I'm a little worn out. Yep. Good job, Eloise. Tap, tap, tap. All right. Look at this, you guys. So, um, uh, well, we got, we served for three hours and 10 minutes in game. We started at for uh 3 55 p.m and then at 7 p.m uh, we got like four customers eight dishes 85 percent quality 77 percent satisfaction <laughs> it's kind of low but at least it's more than more than what we expected i expected to have a lower rating actually but this is perfect uh we got like uh oh we get a profit of 541 awesome and uh, yep looking good so far in our first in our soft opening <laughs> we, we made like a thousand uh credits from that all right all right see you around eloise yeah, take care going home and that is the soft opening you guys look at this wow every everyone is here it looks like you are getting the hang of running a restaurant that was great wasn't it boba I think Boba is this frog right here <laughs> on top of her head. Not many people knew about Lizzie Koya right now. Mm, I got you. I got it. Uh, you should uh, do a grand opening. We can make a big celebration and attract a lot of customers. That does sound like a good idea, but let's let snack decide on when it happens. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, sure. But thank you so much for the... Um, encouragement you guys i'm sure running a restaurant is hard hosting a big grand opening sounds like a lot of pressure the food wasn't bad but the restaurant looks a bit rundown 
just my two cents. Anyways, ho ho ho, Bianca is always blunt with her words, but she is right. Now you should get give the restaurant a proper makeover before having a grand opening. Awesome. Thank you for the constructive criticism to you guys. Appreciate that. Make a good first impression, you know. Uh, speak to Prisca at the town hall. She manages all the properties and handles renovations. I'm sure she can help get those old floors replaced. Oh, one last thing. I have some old furniture lying around. Maybe one of those can look great in your restaurant. Wow. Wow. This looks nice. Uh, rare. Oh, retro style. Modern style. Uh, rustic style. Well, uh, I would like to go to retro style. I love retro, so we'll go ahead with this. Oh, that... That, that gives me an idea. We should have a retro theme in our uh, restaurant if there are like those kind of furnitures that would that would be enough to, you know, to get to that uh, kind of a theme, not just this table that Uriel gave us. So would you look at this, guys? We have a new skill point and ability points right now. So you can see uh, uh, what we need endurance, definitely. And then, so we got health for hunting, uh, fast travel for cooking, uh, for relationship, and another one for cooking. So what else do we need? Oh, well, um... All of these requires two skill points. As of the moment at the left side, we only have one skill point. So we'll just have to wait a little bit longer for us to get another point. So uh, now uh, we need to speak with Prisca at the town hall to have the floors fixed. But it's 7 p.m. Uh, uh, well, we'll just take a quick uh, quick visit if she is still at the town hall. We'll see. Oh, that was fun. I never thought that... You know, uh, it's it was kind of uh, overwhelming at first because it's our very first time to to manage a restaurant, but it's kind of fun because we get to do what we love doing, which is cooking at the same time, serving to the people that are very hungry and looking forward for a dish, and they love it so much. At the same time, earn from it. It's like more than what I I, I deserve actually as a as a. Uh, new cook in town so i'm really thankful of this uh, opportunity to serve white ash harbor in this way and be a part of the community so now let's uh, head straight to the town hall which is here and again uh the the how the the place was designed like you have to go up instead of going straight flat like this it's really smart <laughs> It just adds more debt to it. Oh, it's kind of locked now, so we'll, we'll uh, visit tomorrow. So, yep, the, the the building design is so is is so good. It's like when you're eating uh, food, you get to experience not just one uh, texture, not just one taste, but like uh, m multiple of them, uh, but in a very uh, satisfying way. <laughs> That's how I see the building designs, anyways. Or it's just it, maybe it's just me. Okay, let's head straight to bed. Uh, it was it was a very long day, but I'm glad we finally got some soft opening and got some constructive criticisms from uh, our most trusted people in the town, which will we will definitely uh, consider. And oh well, looks like I'm gonna have a very good night's sleep tonight, day tomorrow. Well, four months earlier. All right, okay. Looks like we are dreaming from our past. Oh, looks like, look at this kitchen. It's so busy. And we have here, is this Chef Castillo? Few top sirloin tartars with micro greens. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. <laughs> Four chocolate lava cakes. Yes, chef. <laughs> oh, this is auto. Okay. Snap. You sure took your time with that bathroom break. Get back to your station and now. We need an order of wagyu with cherry sauce get it get on it all right looks like we are uh working as you can see uh the kitchen is so busy oh okay there's a mini game oh this is so fast one more oh that's a miss there you go that's good that's great perfect oh this is so fast you guys so the 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 more expensive or the higher quality the the ingredients are the the harder to play the mini game, which is I like. But while you watch Cherry Sauce, 67% rating. Uh, I'm not sure if he's gonna like it. Are we serving dogs here? I don't. I didn't know we were served dogs. Take this outside and feed it to the dog. Oh, that's so rude, man. And while you're out there, don't come back inside. Maybe tomorrow you could try to make some food humans can eat. That is so rude, you auto. Anyway, it's his problem. Oh, while you're out, go to the doctor and get your taste buds checked. He's not done. <laughs> oh my. This is. The this is the rudest person I've ever, I've ever I've encountered in my whole life. They don't seem to be working. Oh, then that broke our heart. Oh, well, there are always people, even in real life, you know. But uh, one thing I learned is that uh, we couldn't control what, uh, you know, we, we, we can never control what the people or the world throws at us, but we can control how we respond to it. And uh, 
on my end as much as possible i always try to respond first with prayer to ask uh, god and how i will respond to it and yeah this, this is the same answer always be patient and kind because people need it that's it because that is what love is really and don't dwell on on those uh negative stuff and focus on um the work at the task at hand okay see you soon who is this hi friend i have a short vacation coming up and i've decided where i want to go white ash harbor you didn't think i would sit on the sidelines and watch did you i want to see for myself what you are capable of accomplishing with your restaurant oh camille <laughs> nice oh at least we have an old friend coming in town that's gonna be fun so now um we're gonna uh, speak with Fresca and see what we can do in our what we can do to renovate our uh, restaurant so definitely we're gonna work with the floors first because uh, yeah i gotta say that the flooring is looks so bad it could uh really benefit on a makeover oh wait hold on what is this place oh okay uh this is actually the hotel we just went to the other entrance uh okay uh, let's answer information why this is hotel rose a famous historic site of white ash harbor when princess El eliza a second first landed here over 200 years ago she fell in love with the beach and built this magnificent hotel for her court to come visit ah this is that sounds so good where should i go relax well besides the famous bath house you can relax at the tourist beach just east of town okay where can i go you can find white ash harbor's popular takoyaki shop for the docks okay for the drinks you can check out base bar okay um what else okay got any advice for me uh make sure to decorate your restaurant it really improves the guest experience and they may leave more tips awesome thank you so much for that and with that being said we're gonna head straight to the townhouse uh today is thursday um should be opening any moment now hi uriel all right you guys we are here oh looks like we have a cut scene Hello? Is Preska here? Oh boy, what just happened? Something fell down. Okay, if you come back again, you'll be sorry. <laughs> what happened? Oh, what now? Hey, snap. It's been a rough day. Oh, she looks so angry, you guys. Pardon the commotion. I was in the middle of, you know, something. So, Lisi Koya, huh? Tell me, what is your vision for it? Okay, a simple but classy spot for folks to eat. Well, this is, this sounds comfortable, but I wanted to really, uh, you know, go beyond my limits to so a place that pushes the culinary envelope. Yep. Let's do this. Well, don't go too far out. It could scare away folks from White Ash Harbor. Oh, well, it's better than not trying. <laughs> Hazel told me you might come by. Lisikoya is a really old building, and I remember the floors needed to be replaced. I can help, but I'll need something first. Yeah, our carpenter lost his tools when he was doing some work on the bathhouse. If you can go in and find them, we would happily give Lisikoya a fix-up. Why can't he just get them? What is he doing in the... Okay, let's do this. Uh, now that you've mentioned it, he didn't say. <laughs> there have been some sightings of activities going on inside the bathhouse, even though it's supposed to be abandoned. Yep. <laughs> Regardless, his tools are expensive to replace and getting them will all allow us to fix your floors. I could have retrieved the tools, but uh, I'm too busy to look around in a haunted bathhouse. <laughs> Very busy both day and night. Busy. <laughs> okay well that's fine for so you just go ahead and take some good rest pretty sure you'll have your you know whatever is uh getting into you it will be gone when you wake up hopefully okay uh so we're gonna go to the abundant hunted uh bathhouse like i said uh it, this game also took some uh few inspirations from uh, spirited away so we're gonna be expecting some uh spooky things going on uh right now we are yep i think the bathhouse is at the right side like this do you remember the spirited away there were some statues like this going to the the town the ghost town so it's kind of like that and uh okay we have a that scene uh, going on mm. would you look at this you guys Th this looks so creepy but look at this it's just beside uh a water a body of water right here at the left side could be a hot spring i can't wait for us to pretty sure we could we should be able to uh fix this bathhouse or okay there are overgrown plants right now oh man it looks so dilapidated okay um oh, we need to look for the tool right it's kind of locked here um let's see all right something's going on here oh we just saw someone here he ran away okay we could search this i should keep searching okay so oh, there is uh this one it, it's like a uh, sprinkling nope not here a glimmer uh there's more here no nope. oh got him 
carpentry tools awesome but i want to go up further because i think i just saw someone here and he just uh, ran away let's go explore this hunted abandoned uh bath house and looks like uh well that's it that's it for our uh ghost hunting <laughs> we'll just head straight and deliver this carpentry tools to Prisca. I'm pretty sure she's gonna be very happy that she'd lift up her mood at least. Oh, uh, let's just get some screenshot. All right. And uh, would you look at that, you guys? We have some mushrooms growing over here. I just have to harvest all of them. Let's take some time. All right, we got like five uh, mushrooms from that. Do you know about the polite society? Yeah, I want. Okay, that's that's a good group. <laughs> okay, let's head straight to Prisca and uh, can't wait see here reaction oh she's still mad the tools thank you so much what a relief we've had so many projects on hold no one would get them from the very hunted old bathhouse i thought you said it was possibly hunted i did say that yes and you did it yay <laughs> we can fix your floors now please choose a floor style that you would like the first renovation is on the house wow that is so cool Okay, I, I want a retro style uh, floor. Um, let's see, blue tile, orange tile, oak, uh, terracotta, purple. Hmm. Okay, we also have here. Oh, okay. This one requires story act two. Requires scale the research facility. Uh, okay. Well, I wanted my place to look a bit of a uh, retro. So I think purple will do. We have a we have a uh, red uh, retro uh, table, and I think the closest color to retro is purple. Uh, let's do that. Are you sure you want me to install purple tile flooring? Let's put, uh, yep. I'll have the carpenter move over to the restaurant ASAP. This is a great help to the town thing. Thank you, Priska. You have a wonderful day. Don't mind the commotions. It's just part of it. Don't let it take away your peace. As my uh, parents always say, let go and let God. Because <laughs> you know, if we, if we, if we force things that is not within our control, definitely the result is just like Chris's, um situation right now. Her peace has been taken away. So that's why I let go and let God. Anyway, I can't wait for us to check out Lizzie Koya's new flooring. Hey, uh, Hazel, uh, I just got the floor renovated come visit soon okay oh it's locked okay oh uh, okay the restaurant is being renovated today uh in this case uh let's go straight to um the person who can train us with serious hunting and that is uh the old lady i think and uh along the way let's just pick up these uh red uh crunchy apples and also uh harvest these mushrooms oh it looks like we have a boar here oh stay away go away because they had a history of attacking tourists so we need to oh we have peasants one of our main dish we need i just feel that we need to hunt them down this is one of our main dish you guys we have three pheasants here oopsie okay it's ran away going east and the hunt is on and there she is all right we got two uh pheasant meat uh, it's almost 2 p.m i think we'll just have to go straight to the um veteran hunter and but well, well i couldn't just i couldn't resist these uh strawberries so let's just uh pick him up this is there's also a nice house here uh we're gonna visit it later uh, uh this, there she is i think this is her oh pamarine yep uh, running into people only reminds me how much i miss the quiet of the forest okay i, I need to train archery makeshift oak bow iron spade rusted wiring can we have a wood staff oh okay uh common hunting tool uh well i don't have this yet and we have credits so let's just buy this uh-huh we also don't have the iron spade but i don't think we need we need it for now all right that should do it oh boy this is also locked <laughs> oh there's a way here all right okay i think uh we'll just go ahead and continue hunting some pheasants and along the way some few honeycombs and we have uh, a lot of uh mushrooms here if you hear that guys that's my daughter singing shouting <laughs> Uh, she's a ball of energy you guys she just like by the time she wakes up just run around and when it's almost night time she's about to sleep there's no hint of her really getting tired she just falls asleep like it, she did a very long job <laughs> and that job is running dancing which reminds me to you know to, to take it easy in life and you know enjoy what you're doing although uh, we have some responsibilities in life already as an adult but i'm happy that we're still able to uh play some games just like this and uh let's just hunt down this oh i'm wondering I always wanted to see if we could we could arrow from here oh there you go we could nice so we could we could exploit this you guys look at this 
but uh, it will take a very long time. So uh, let's just focus on hunting this peasant first. Oh, nice. We got that. <laughs> 4 p.m. now. We still have uh, time. And hey, would you look at this, everyone? Uh, we now have uh, two skill points. Now we'll just, let's decide where we could um, upgrade. Oh, yeah, yeah, this one. You might discover new recipes when reading books and library. This one. This one is really useful. I want to have more recipes because uh, I am really excited what kind of food we can cook and serve to our friends here in White Ash Harbor. Um, there's a lot of good perks here. Anyway, let's think about that later. And now let's focus on the hunt. And oh man, oh geez, he remembers us. This guy. No, I don't want to. Oh man. Oh, looks like we can hunt him down. And it's easier to hunt because he doesn't run away, I think. Oh, he's running away. But it's big. It's big, not unlike the peasant that they're too small. When they run away, they're very hard to hit. And where is he now? There he is. Okay, looks like he got tired. And one more hit. Oh, I don't want to hit this guy here. I don't want to fight uh, two of them. There you go. Oop. Oh, man. I did not notice our energy. We just fainted while hunting. <laughs> that was fun. And here we have Valentina again. Holding us for not taking care of our health. I have uh, this. Okay. Yep. Yep. 110 credits. Man, can I go back to, to that uh, the deer? A deer or a moose? I'm not sure. I think it's a moose. So it's, yeah, it's it's now the next day, right? I believe it's now 10 a.m. Oh, man, that, that was so, so unfortunate. Anyway, guys, for more videos, you can look at the lower part of the screen. We're going to play in more of Chef RPGs. So thank you again for hanging out. And if you're new, feel free to like, subscribe. And we always walk with patience and kindness because that is what love is. See you on the next Chef RPG video. Goodbye.